guys um, <laughs> I want to show you something the view from the top on the way there is Jabalibir if you can see the road going up my camera this way I always thought this place is super secret but I don't know if you can see this but there are plenty of cars already set up for camping so yeah thankfully I'm not staying here I will go forward hiking and hopefully I'll find some nice place to sleep in the tent in the mountains but the view is beautiful isn't it I actually didn't start hiking yet and look at this view already is so beautiful the path is not clear at all <laughs> at least here so I guess I will just end up finding my own way hopefully I will just go up to this mountain and if there is internet, I will stay and camp there for night. I go down here and I'm now at this kind of plateau. Um, to be honest, it's so much green here if you can see this in the background. I think this is because there are no goats here. Usually goats love to eat this plant. I didn't have a good mood today, to be honest. But I pushed myself and I and uh, drove here all the way up to this mountain now to go hiking and I feel so good now I really feel super happy and calm and peaceful finally I am in the right place actually it seems like there is a path here but it's quite unclear and probably I will lose it on the way Let's see where it leads for now. So I reached this point. It's quite a deep valley here. So I'm not sure if it's a good idea to go through it. I'll check maybe I will climb there and check from the top what's the best way to pass it. <laughs> Here is valley or wadi. Uh, it's very beautiful by the way. Look how much green around. However, I need to go down and pass it. And I think this is the only way down here. And then inshallah I will climb up there. Can you hear this? I just saw a goat. Actually, I thought it was a human being. And at first I got excited, then scared. This is basically a place where the water comes down from the mountains. And you can know it uh, because the stones are like flat shaped. And of course, because there's so much green here. And look at this. Nature will always find its way. You need to see it. There's so much grass now. How green! It is in the middle of winter. And this is the way where the water comes up from the mountains. I need to be here when it's raining. The sun is almost down, so time to look for 
a good place to set up the tent. I just only walked three kilometers, imagine. But it's very tiring because down there in the middle there is valley, so you have to go down, 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 and then climb up again. And I am still climbing up here. But now the weather is amazing. It's windy. Oh wow, look at this view. But I really need to go more up. The ideal location would be up there. Remember how I was telling you at the beginning about my bad mood? It's gone. <laughs> this is unbelievable. having a hard time choosing a place to camp but I guess I will stay here already because the view is amazing and I have signal also which is very important <laughs> ah. <gasps> this was so painful so um, at least I will not feel lonely because there are city lights in the background and tomorrow I guess I will go for exploration hike. I will show you where up there. Time to look for the wood. And since we are at the top of the mountain, there is a very low possibility to find something here. So I will give you advice. Always look for where the water goes down because this is where it's gonna take all the wood with it. So that's where I'm heading. This kind of wood that I am carrying here is gonna uh, burn very fast. So I'm still trying to search for something else and down there there is wadi so I guess there would be a lot of wood and this wood obviously is dry because I would never, maybe in case of emergency only, break a tree or a plant that is alive. So as I was climbing up a little bit. I dropped my phone somewhere. So I will try to find it now, but I don't have high hopes to be honest. <laughs> Good luck to me. I don't even remember which way I came from. It's unbelievable really bad look. <laughs> and I was looking for it and praying. Please God, please let me find it. But uh, to be honest, I was sure that God will help me find it. So here it is. And I was already up there. Finally. My tent actually almost flew away. Look, there is mountain edge down there. It's not that windy, but I forgot to put something inside. Don't do the same mistake. So I will be starting to cook now my dinner because I am starving. So it's gonna be sweet potato lentils curry. Uh, I have onion here, tomato, two garlic cloves, and this is chili, olive oil, and spices, and coconut milk. So I already put olive oil inside. Once the olive oil is hot already, I'm just putting garlic 
Next, I will throw this little devil <laughs> spices. I will put tomato. And after that, I'm gonna uh, throw the sweet potato also. Now, the sweet potato needs some time to cook. And also, I'll put a little bit of water. We'll wait some time and let it cook. Now, because sweet potato is almost ready, I'm gonna add the lentils. And the coconut milk. this one cooking on a very small fire and I have to start this fire because I will make a bread Food is ready. I am starving. Okay, let's start. I'm not gonna wait anymore. We will try the bread first. I said that even though if it's not gonna be good, it's still gonna be so tasty to me, but it is really tasty. <laughs> and the bread. I'm so full after uh, my dinner, but since I'm moving slowly to go to bed, I will just drink some tea. And this is my favorite camping mug with moments. It used to be my favorite cartoon when I was a kid. It gave me so many ideas for adventure and so on. My god, a snake! <laughs> there was a snake! I'm not a fan of snakes. <laughs> um, that's why it's a reminder always to put everything inside the tent shoes, backpack, anything that they would have a chance to get into and hide but we also have to remember that it's us human beings who are in their habitat not the opposite it's time for me to go to sleep hopefully I will get some sleep because it's full moon <laughs> anyways I'll see you tomorrow
actually. Good morning. What a beautiful morning. I'm gonna prepare breakfast now and <laughs> obviously coffee. <laughs> the oats that I already have from home uh, cooked with coconut milk, which is already boiling. Okay, slow down, slow down. So there's some oats and chia seeds, cinnamon, cardamom, and other spices. The breakfast is ready, now I am gonna boil water and I have coffee here also. Voila! <laughs> bon appétit! Breakfast with the view. Okay, let's do the breakfast. everything I put back my tent so I'm pretty much ready to go further I said it's gonna be much lighter today because I ate and drank a majority of things from inside it but still anyways and just to show you a quick update i'm gonna go up check this mountain i'm gonna go back down to the valley then go a little bit more to the left and then up again and there i will go back this way to my car so yeah if you are ready we can go <laughs> after all i will have to go down this way and then hopefully go up there uh, and go on the top I do have dilemma because it's getting quite hot hmm. I really want to go up but it will require some climbing somewhere this way so I found this plant I actually forgot its name but it's very healthy and people from the mountains eat it I think with salt or with lemon juice but I remember it is not tasty at all anyway let me try because long time I didn't eat it so inside it looks like that <laughs> it's super bitter I just found the goat path, so I will follow it. After all, goats know the best where to go. <laughs> so this is it. This is the top. It's about 930 meters above the sea level. Mm -hmm. 